East Germany would take garbage trucks and go and throw garbage on the other side of the wall. This continued for some time and West Germany kept on wondering how to respond and eventually the voice of reason prevailed. West Germany built a candy store on the other side of the wall, that is East Germany, put some candy and some soda and erected a banner and the banner read, each gives what each has. Each gives what each has. Here's what happened prior to that. Hey, welcome back. I'm glad you've clicked in. If you've not subscribed, now is the time to do so. Like, comment, share, and click that notification bell on so you won't miss a single video each time that I upload. Let's get into the story. Between 1961 and 1989, history records that there was a Berlin Wall. Yes, Berlin was divided between East Germany and West Germany. This came as a result of the Second World War. And after the Second World War, some countries felt that they had different ideologies. And this led to the separation between communists and capitalists. East Germany and West Germany. Germany, the decision was made to put up a wall that the people from the West Germany did not come to East and people from the East did go to the West. East Germany was comprised of some of the USSR countries, the Soviet countries. In West Germany were countries like the French, US, UK, yeah. And this continued for some time and it led to something history calls the Cold War. There were existing tensions all through. There was some possibility of even a third world war. Fortunately, that never came to pass. So, during the time the war was there, East Germany tried to provoke West Germany as much as they can. They took garbage trucks and went and threw garbage on the other side of the wall, that is West Germany. This continued for some time, and history records that West Germany wanted to respond, and eventually the voice of reason prevailed. West Germany put up a candy stall and put some soda on the other side of the wall, that is East Germany. They then erected a banner, and the banner read, each gives what each has. Yes, each gives what each has. Simply meaning, East Germany, you have garbage to give, we have candy and soda to give. Eventually, the wall was brought down during the 1989 and the country became one sovereign state. And we never had a third world war. Deriving lessons from that, I found it very interesting that most other times that we get offended, and we offend people too. Most of the times that things happen to us and things happen through us. And sometimes not only good things happen, but bad things really happen. And also, most times we have negative things and negative thoughts. How do we respond? Are we the people who, when they're thrown garbage at, we take the garbage and throw back? Or are we people who rise above that? And respond at a higher level. In her book, The Becoming, Michelle Obama states that when they go low, we go high. She went ahead and explains how we are supposed to fight on a higher level than the person fighting us. And this analogy is played best by the ego. Whenever an ego catches a snake, it doesn't find the snake on the ground. It flies as high as it can where the attitude where the snake is lifeless and the ego has an easy time. So, in life, as you're going ahead with your day, do you fight people at their level or do you fight people at your level? Do you respond or do you react? When people throw garbage at you, what will you do? The analogy of the ego is something we really need to adapt. And I suggested to you today, when somebody comes and does wrong to you, somebody comes and hurts you, negative things happen, 
take a step back and think how you can go above it how you can go higher than them and fight them at your own level my uncle once told me if you wrestle with a pig in the dirt the pig will enjoy it but you'll get angry and dirty yes the pig thrives well in the dirt but me i don't thrive well in the dirt so i get both angry and dirty if you fight people at their level people who have committed their life to me to misunderstand you people who have committed their lives to annoy you people who have committed their lives to to bring you down people who have made a commitment to see you coming down crashing if you fight them at their level you get angry crushed disappointed depressed you will get all sorts of negativity coming your way but if you fight them at your level when they go low and you go high you will not only win the battle but you'll be at peace and you leave an example for people to keep on emulating so when people come and pull an east berlin on you what do you do do you pull up a west berlin or do you pull up an east berlin until next time stay safe and stay blessed don't forget